So we want to talk a little bit about your dining space now. You know, depending on how you roll, you might want to go more formal or you might want to go a little bit more casual. So a couple yes. of options you brought out for us, Kimberly. Well, really, by the time you get to decorating something fine-tuning like the table, you already know whether your house is formal or casual. It's kind of a big sweeping category. So right. one of the tip-offs, if you're deciding that you're going to go a little bit more casual in general, would be a lighter colored wood. So in general, you're thinking of staining the floor, should I go dark, should I go light? You're asking yourself, is my house going to be casual, is my house going to be formal? If it's yeah. casual, it should generally be lighter. This is kind of a take on the Parsons table, by the way, so that yeah. Suzanne was talking about. It's one of those classic pieces. They've made it more modern by creating this interesting edge detail. And then we're layering this table with things that are casual, with things that are humble, with things that you probably already own and have around the house. But we luckily got to go shopping at Williams Sonoma and Pottery Barn. So we've got a couple of runners here layered so you get this nice grass cloth texture oh, I like and that. a nice stripe here we've got a woven uh, place mat no what do you call this charger charger thanks yeah. Trace thanks for paying attention you know I really actually know about something that belongs I'm in the so, kitchen now I'm that's so weird to that's have what's you. weird about that no, you've changed <laughs> you've changed and you've grown a wonderful lovely striped napkin and then you know just an inexpensive thing to do people love when you've taken the time to come up with a seating arrangement and you personalize it I yeah. think that's so, yeah, so it is. A little really chalkboard there that goes on the table. And it's a nice way to, we often when we're entertaining, we'll split up the couples so that, you know, there's You're a little bit more energy. You're one of those people that do that, huh? I am one of those people. I actually have no problem with that. I think it's it's fun. And if you're inviting yeah. the right people, it doesn't matter who's sitting beside who, No, and right? it makes the conversation more exciting. So yeah. casuals, layers, a little less matchy-matchy. We've got things on an angle. We've got this great cutting board that's used as a plinth to raise everything up. And then just to keep the price really where you want it to be, flowers from the garden. You know, it won't be very long. It seems impossible right now, but soon we're going to have flowers coming up, and you'll just be able to go on and cut casual buds and, and keep it really simple. Slip covered furniture, again, super casual. So if you're thinking, you know, I'm decorating the house, I do slip covers, is it a casual space? Then it could work very well. Right. Is it a formal space? Then it's really not going to work very well at all. Right. Yeah. Very practical, though. You can always take those off and wash them. I like the whole warmth of this table. Simple, casual, it's simple, very affordable. It's warm, it's yeah. affordable. Okay, so now we're getting a little fancy. This is where we get Look at our fancy, fancy. Our sort of our, our, our more traditional table. I like this too, actually. Again, isn't it beautiful? Mm -hmm. And again, you're not you're not going to put this very formal table into a house that's super casual and vice versa. So this right. is going to be working with what you already have. In general, the dark wood that you see there, one of the most formal looks you can do is to have your dark wood table exposed. So I wanted to show that you could set this table and have the wood exposed. A nice gleaming finish suggests that it's super, you know, high and dressy. A white tablecloth is a classic, never goes out of style, so always have one of those, easy to take care of in the long run as well. Yeah. And then most of us, when we went out and got married, registered for beautiful white dishes, maybe it had a platinum ring or a gold ring, those are never going to go out of style. You might want to layer them with a dessert plate that's got a pattern, and that way you can introduce a little color and, and jazz into things. And then again, people want to have their place setting uh, identified. So we've got a little mum in a, in a dish and under a cloche and then everybody can see where they sit. That is so, isn't that sweet? Cute. It's a small thing and it, it's you know, lovely. Completely inexpensive but what yeah. it does is it just says that you went to a little bit of trouble. You have these people coming over for dinner anyway. Yes. You want to make them feel very special. Very nice. Okay the other thing you've done which I think is always great is when you go to some yeah. uh, someone's house and they've got a menu set out there. Yeah. So you've got a little menu there, and mine would say macaroni take out. and cheese. No, mine would say take out. <laughs> no, but take out from you this just, particular you restaurant. You just print that off your own printer on a little card stock so and use cute. a pretty font. And, you know, again, the flowers, I, I used to, you know, attempt to do these elaborate flower arrangements and what yeah. I found is by the time I got to dinner I was exhausted and nobody likes a bitter host. No. <laughs> no. So keep the flowers simple. Tulips are beautiful this time of year and we mixed in two colors just to keep it a little bit more casual. But even the furniture in this situation is more tailored. Yes. You know you've got cleaner lines, you've got this nice uh, nail head detail that's going around, a little sparkle, a little bling. So keep once you identify whether your house is formal or casual, it really can help you make all those decorating decisions all through the years. That's right, and yeah. it becomes a little easier, and by yeah. the vase is beautiful, by the way. Thank you, and the furniture and the tables, by the way, from LT, so yes. we had fun shopping this time. Good to know. Okay.